the summer hurdle is next. It's a listed hurdle race. Uh, let's get a look at the list. Two miles and one furlong naught to 140. Samurai King at the top for Paul Rhodes, Villano Beach, Darren Thompson, Shapeshifter, Joshua Sutherland, Vanity Gaze Post, David Robertson, Ursula Prime, Paul Rhodes, BNS Craig Beckwith, Italian Stallion, Daniel French, Sermons Machine, Matt Cooper, Cock and Hin, 10, Derek Hinton, Miles Aura, Thomas Rogers, Go Go Girls, Derek Hinton, Nanina Tramp, Alex Cherry and Ori Ferrer for Matt Cooper, a field of 13. In this one, I've been called into race. Uh, ready to go, and away we go. So, Orifera is the first to show from Italian Stallion and Sermon's Machine. Looks like Derek Hinton is the unfortunate soul who's got the wrong silks in this race because I'm not in it as they get to the first, which they're all safely over, and Derek Hinton has. Stolen Darren Thompson silks for this race. Well, he's on the outside. I can't imagine Darren Thompson having a horse called Cock and Hen 10 or Go Go Girls, but Derek Hinton, yes, I can. So, Ori Ferrer in the lead by about five lengths, getting into the third. To Italian Stallion on the inside in second. And Cock and Hen 10 and Ursula Prime, Samurai King and Villano Beach. Darren Thompson has got one in this and he's Villano Beach, so maybe yes, Derek Hinton's too hard running in that. I wonder if I've seen things there for a minute. Derek Hinton around has got two or three different sets of silks, so he's got a set slipped in there that I hadn't noticed, but no, there are definitely three already in those old Sheikh Mohammed colours of Darren Thompson. Ori Ferret in the lead. I'm pretty sure when I first started commentating, Darren Thompson had silks like the ones Matt Cooper's got now. But maybe that's my mind playing tricks. And Italian standing in his second, Cock and Hen 10 is third, then Ursula Prime. And Samurai King, Miles Aura, and Nina Tramp. Back in those days when I first started, Paul Rhodes and Joshua Sutherland both had identical silks. You can imagine how difficult that was because they were both right at the top of the jump street. Much of a way to tell them apart. Ori Ferrer is clear in front from Italian Stallion in second. Cogan in 10 third. And Samurai King and Urshida Prime. We've got three running in those colours as well. But I think they're actually right because I think Paul Rose has taken up those colours this season and the ones that are slightly different are yellow. Daniel French's, and I think he uses them sometimes as well, so not quite a clash there. Although, if you glance up to that graphic in the top corner, they look the same, don't they? But they're not. Once they get over the eight, that's the third from home, and Italian Stallion has jumped into the lead. The Italian Stallion then from Ursula Prime, and Ori Ferrer BNS has now come through to throw down a challenge. The one that's making a bit of ground on the outside is Miles Aura. With Villano Beach also trying to get into it. But it's Italian Stallion who's got the rail and got the lead. From Orifera and BNS, Miles all on the outside. Ursula Prime still there. Villano Beach trying to run on. Shapeshifter is trying to get into it. That's not had much of a mention so far either. But it's Italian Stallion who continues to lead with two flights to take. That's the second last. And Italian Stallion's over in front. Ursula Prime is second, BNS is third, then Go Go Girls and Shapeshifter, one or two of them behind are pushing hard, but that leader took a dive at that one, and that could have cost him the race, but here comes Shapeshifter around the outside, Ursula Prime though starts to kick on, and suddenly it's Ursula Prime from Italian Stallion fighting back, Ursula Prime and Italian Stallion are going to flash past the both together I think, but it's Ursula Prime who's beginning to get down, and Italian Stallion takes it, as Ursula Prime just gave way in the end, Go Go Girls finished well, and a messy end. So that race, it looked as though the Italian Stallion had thrown it away at the last, but fought back. Ursula Prime and Shapeshifter both just went out like lights. It looked like Shapeshifter had come to win that, and it just stopped like it had hit the wall completely. But Italian Stallion for Daniel French is the winner. Go, 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 for Derek Hinton second. Ursula Prime 
for Paul Rhodes was third. BNS Greg Beckwith fourth, and Shapeshifter Joshua Sutherland was fifth.